What is going on, Libra? Welcome to Jewelry Box Hero. It's your girl, Empress Gem, here to drop these jewels. Welcome back to your Spirit Says message. If you're new, welcome. General message, guys. Take what's for you, leave the rest behind. Check your sun, moon, rise of Venus, and your north node placements. Cross watchers, you are welcome to stay. Libra, if this does not resonate, come back. I'll let you get on the next seven to ten days. Personals are open. Today is the 20th. You guys got about a couple days, if you're catching this before June 30th, to book with the coupon code in the description box for a half off. Libra. Mm-mm-mm. Gossip, folks. Okay, anyway. <laughs> anyway. So, what did I write? I wrote. Okay. Thank you, Spirit. So, um... There has been a tower in, in your life. Towers are good, okay? Because it knocks down all that faulty stuff, the, that fox weebles, okay? Fake things, stuff of that nature. So uh, there has been some towers in the connections in your life, whether this is you parting ways with a job, a friend, no longer speaking to a family member. Could be a lover, but it's more, you know, I'm feeling more platonic base here. All right, um, your energy definitely in the building, okay? We also got Capricorn. We have some Scorpio, Aries energy as well, all right? Um, but yeah, you guys have separated from something. Something has came crumbling them down, and I feel, you know, you guys are a little worried about, you know, what can be said or what will be done. Like, um, I do feel like, you know, if I'm feeling like the parting of like best friends or something like somebody knows your secrets or somebody like knows something of you. You wonder if they're going to turn cold or like try to like speak ill of you or, or even if they don't have like facts because I'm looking at gossip and slander. So even if these people like go out and make up stuff on you or try to like black bar you so that you can't, you know, get another job and, you know, the career field that you work in. I feel like these people are seeing justice, like you're still going to come out on top regardless. So do not feel like you've made a bad decision. Um, what else did I see? I feel like you did a lot of this stuff because you were unhappy in a situation. Something was really disrupting you, you know, as far as um, like your desire, like you weren't motivated by something anymore. Like it didn't give you the same feel. And I feel that with this tower and the separation of the energies, you are finding yourself in a very balanced and stable place. But there's like something within you that makes you feel that this may not be of best interest for you. It wasn't a good idea or like you need this back in your life. But no, I feel that this is more of the opposing energy tugging on your I want to say it force fields I guess somebody's tugging on your force fields you know people who literally could be talking about you whether this is good or bad but like your your ears could be ringing a lot from here like people talking about you you know left is typically bad right is usually good well at least in me so you know use your discernment figure that out but I feel like, you know, you could be getting like those type of vibes here. But I feel that, you know, though, like there is like a karmic balance here in regards to how people have done you and are currently still like doing you in your image. More so like it's about your image, like how people are trying to portray you to other folks. So it's like, you know, if you part ways with someone, even on like a very amicable term, as far as you are concerned, um, this person is just, they're upset because they don't have your energy anymore. Like you're not around, you're not messing with them or whatever. Spirit says, stop and just fold the cards. Got it. Okay. Confirmation. Thank you, spirit. Uh, so what do we have here? Okay. Cause they're like, look girl, <laughs> I know. Okay. So what do we have here? Divine Holy Spirit for Libra, Summer, Rise of Venus and the North Node for the next seven days for the highest good. What do they need to know here? Spirit. Okay, it's a few cards. Oh, I guess that's what it is, too. They said, if you want this video short, you need to get <laughs> let us pull. So something about Tuesday, okay? Mars energy, Aries Scorpio energy, like I said, okay? Conflict here. Um, Somebody really trying to disrupt this. Somebody's disgruntled, okay? Thank you. But somebody is trying to disrupt your grounding here is what I wanted to say. All right, somebody's really was really trying to bring that fire to you like that hot that hot mess in your area and your in your dynamic, and, you know, in your force field. Somebody trying to penetrate your force field. But I feel like these people are going to receive karma or they are receiving karma right now. And I feel like they're getting like like something like a double karma because they're already receiving some sort of karma, especially those who did you wrong. Okay, and you part of ways, that is the first part of the karma of not having your energy. But then the second piece is that because 
they're going through a rough time and they're blaming this on you and they're probably projecting and doing stuff it's giving them like a double dose type of energy here yeah roll side shake okay and this person does this on purpose this person always plays on the outside always plays you know second to you they don't mind this shit like they like they need you whoever or whatever this is okay dang spirit we got sunday morning energy here sunday morning Okay, maroon five. Maroon could be a significant color. Five, again, represents change. That tower energy. Okay, could be dealing with a cancer. No, sorry, Leo. I said cancer, so there we go. Maybe there were some things that were hidden that have come to light as well, especially with this judgment card sitting here. Oh, yeah, maybe I'm shedding a light on how somebody had low self-esteem in your friendship. Okay, and I feel like when you part away, you could have, okay, because I'm seeing that relationship card coming through. You could have probably even, like, found love and, like, you're... You're moving on, you're spending more time with your romantic partner, and you have a very jealous friend because they feel like, you know, you have been taken away from them, okay? Um, but we have Sunday morning here, okay? And usually Sunday mornings are easy, you know? Um, at least that's what, who said that? Lionel Richie said that? So, I mean, you know, he was easy, you know, like Sunday morning. So maybe that's like, you know, what it is here, okay? Sunday morning energy. But I feel that, you know, you're like a breath of fresh air, like I said, like somebody looks up to you. And, you know, with the fact that, you know, you moved on or, you know, you're progressing, you know, like I said, a lot of you guys could have parted ties with this energy. But there's something going on with this energy this week or in these next seven days by Tuesday on a Tuesday here. OK, where like you might get a notion you might pay attention to your dreams because maybe that's why I also said that cancer energy like that moon energy. OK, nighttime, pay attention to your dreams. OK. Something honestly could be coming out about this person, especially, okay, let's see, Spirit, what it says, yeah, because they can't come with you, love, you're easy like Sunday morning. What's up with Tuesday? I really feel like there's something in particular about Tuesday for you, Libra. So, maybe if you have, like, a lot of things going on or, like, plans or something like that, like, expect it to still be easy like Sunday morning. Like, you're still going to get through whatever conflict is this is someone's trying to bring to you, yeah. Something with maybe it's a Tuesday within the next two to three months. Okay, so a Tuesday somewhere. I'm really geared towards saying in August. When is August 5th? Oh, well, no, July 4th. July 5th is actually on a Tuesday. So you could have cut this person off two to three months ago. This person, and they've been doing this. And I feel like you're going to get what you need to see. On July 5th. Yeah. Okay. We have wife energy here. So this could have been. Okay. I heard mail order. So this could have been somebody that you know. You got. Married to rather quickly. Okay. That could. For some of you guys are having an issue. That they're not discussing. They're not telling you about this conflict in their life. And they're just like playing it easy. So if your wife. Has been cutting up. You know, they're going through some real serious shit that they're not really trying to let you know. Some of you guys, they could be hiding something here. And I feel like they've been doing some real ill shit for the last two to three months. And it's finally coming out. Uh, for some of you guys, I feel that you could have, you could be in this process of getting away from this wife. And it's been going on for the last two to three months. There's a grandfather involved here. I'm hearing for some of you guys, he is not alive, but he's he's guiding you. He's here, yeah. Telling you to save. You need to get away from this person. So some of you guys, okay, let's see. Yeah, because your life is cute, calm, and cool. See cube, someone is big mad. Okay, beauty, glamour, spell. Know that God sees all. One more here. Casket sharp. Okay, Scorpio energy here. Thinking seven of swords, Aquarius energy. Okay. Something is over, though. Hierophant Taurus energy. So, you could be going through some sort of legalities. Okay, you could have found something out maybe through friends or something like that. Or you could be, It's something with friends. You could be staying with friends. Some, they could be showing up. Okay. But you could be getting away from a spouse. This could have been taking like two to three months. Something on Tuesday is going to go possibly in your favor. This person is going to be in conflict, but things are going to go easy. This this person that you're getting away from is really pissed off because things are over. Like, there's no chance of reviving this situation. Okay, there were things that this person did 
behind the scenes. I mean, this could be a wife that a husband is doing this too, but there was things that was done behind the scenes that um, this person thought no one saw, but the higher up seen it. Yeah, going for a loaf of bread, eight of cups. You're finally getting to walk away from a situation here, okay? Pisces energy. Dreams. That's why I said pay attention to your dreams. I can't take it anymore. You're seeing the shit in your dreams, okay? When you're asleep, pay attention. Yeah, get a pet, get a hobby. I'm telling you right now, get a journal. Write these things down, record them. Somebody's also going to come clean to you guys about what they've really been doing. Yeah, and this shit going to blow your mind. They've been doing some wild ass shit. For real. You need to save your money. Save your energy, save your time, not deal with this. Yeah, this person be lurking, they be watching. They're watching your every move only because they're trying to figure out if you know what's going on with them. They want to know if you know what they know about them, okay? Like that type of energy right there. Anything else, Spirit? That's a lot. I'm cutting it right here. They said, don't you dare. Fine. I'm just going to read these off then because there's a lot. There's an officer involved. Okay. This is another story. Because I had to. Yeah. Okay. There's an officer. Laws involved here. Possibly there's an ex-boyfriend. Okay. We have an ex-boyfriend. We got a DCF case here. Mm-hmm. Somebody ex playing a lot of games. Yeah. They could have gotten a ticket here. Possibly with your kids. They could have been drinking. This is something that they've done, that they've done before. Okay. Somebody might have to actually take a child's parents to court to set up visitation or better visitation here or something like this. Yeah, I know what you did last summer. There's an aunt involved. Oh, okay. They talk behind your back. <laughs> but this person is fake as hell. They don't have their shit together, but they talk about you and your parenting skills. There could be an ex here who's trying to get your kids taken away from you. Okay. Trying to say that you be doing all type of wild shit. But I feel like they're they're crying wolf. This is somebody who's crying wolf. Yeah, because you're bad as shit. Okay. If I had a doubt for a time, like this is somebody who keeps saying this, and I feel like nobody's believing them. Yeah, because you're elevating and they're mad. Okay, we have Gemini energy here, okay? But this is um Gemini is the child, like somebody is upset. They're and they're handling things in a childish manner. This could be dealing with twins, children, okay, two kids. But somebody's upset. You could have set boundaries because how you communicate it to them is expected. Yeah. Solar chakra, how things should work out between you guys. Okay. Eight of Pentacles, Virgo energy. Yeah, but nothing came out of the situation. They didn't listen. And I feel like, but it's like, I don't know. They're doing petty shit. Yeah, this person's a liar. This person, they're receiving judgment. This There's a lot of judgment that's still going on. So if you're dealing with a situation like... And you have to go to court because they could. I'm picking up that there's a divorce that's taking place here, and then there's a child support situation or like custody or visitation or something. The pe the person, the people who are doing like the foul shit, like this lying ass person who's trying to lie on you and your parents and skills, and they aren't even doing half of what is asked of them. Yeah, cause yeah, and they said yeah, they try to make it seem like they do, they don't. Um, there's justice that's going to be served in this situation here for you, Libra, okay? Somebody's just really upset. Like, the energies around you for the next seven days are just really upset at how you handle yourself in situations. Like, I'm also picking up, going back to, like, if you're with somebody or you share assets, somebody really thought they was going to bleed you dry of everything, but little do they know, you know how to, um, budget well with your money and things of that nature, so nothing's lost here, that's why that acorn energy was here, yeah, peace, this is all you cared for and you wanted was your peace, your happiness, your peace, okay, and I feel like this week you're really going to find a lot of it here, somebody's going to be in a lot of grief and wanting your forgiveness here because you left them alone, like I said, okay, you found that confidence, that motivation, okay, you deci decided to follow your, your, de your true desires and you started working with like-minded people, you got away from these energies around you, okay, um, something about the fall season with you guys, okay? Aside from the fact that you are a fall season zodiac, well, here, over here, over here. All right, but we have grief. I understand that losing something is an opportunity to appreciate it. Forgiveness, I acknowledge that harboring resentment blocks the flow of love and loneliness. I know that I am never alone. All right, so, mm-mm-mm. <laughs> 1444, as I said that part. 
Yes, Libra, that has been your message. The scales are balancing in your favor, though, sweetheart. So you have nothing to essentially work, worry about or work work yourself up about, okay? That's the thank you. Work yourself up about, okay? Everything is working out as it should for you. So that has been your message. I really hope that has helped. I love your face. Until the next time we speak, peace out.